I'm nervous because Sirius went on a date with Flav and she came back talking about it was the best date of her life and she was eliminated. It's possible I could be eliminated. I'm not sure how this night will end, to be quite honest. I can't even see like how hot it would stay after today. <laughs> Raw chicken, to me, that was like a ticket home. Waiting in line, I always get goosebumps and chills. But then I'm saying to myself, New York, stay strong, because this is a man you will one day be with. Nobody can with fate. I'll be glad if New York goes home tonight. I'm really tired of seeing Shrek walk around the house. I just want to say, I'm having a lovely time with all of you ladies. But one of you must go home tonight. Now, when I'm standing in front of these girls every night and I'm doing my elimination ceremonies, I ain't gonna lie, be kind of touching your boy. But gotta be done. Everybody can today. Whoever get a clock, you know what time it is. First one that's gonna get a clock from Flav tonight. Pumpkin. <laughs> you know what time it is. Yes, I do. I'm sorry about the chicken. Let me do it like this. Red Oyster and Hottie, like if the both of them stay tonight, I'm seriously considering moving out my room. Red Oyster, come get your clock. You know what time it is. I know what time it is. I made it through another round. But yet, at the same time, I have to room with Hottie. From the dock, private stock, let me get another clock. Right? Word. Come on, Hoops. I think that Flav does like Hoops, but just looking long term, I don't know if they'd be happy together. Hoops. You know what time it is. Mm -hmm. Feels good to be part of the final seven. It feels really good. I'm still here, so I'm happy. About four o'clocks left. I am worried about being eliminated because I slept through the day. I just felt like it was so disrespectful because he's just in there for me. New York. When Flav called my name, I wasn't, you know, surprised, but I was glad I didn't have to wait anymore. I can just go up there, get my clock from my man. And you know what time it is, baby girl. I sure do. <laughs> New York. He picked the bitch. She's the one that walks around here with her head stick up her ass. Eeny, beeny, money, mo. I just cannot let her go. Everything is goldy. <laughs> I continue to be, you know, warm and nice and caring and all of that wrapped up into one thick girl. <laughs> you know what time it is. I do. Come on, Somali. You <laughs> still owe me a day. Hey, listen, I was going to say, and I still owe you a date, uh -huh. so you know what time it is. I do. Okay. What's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Me or Sweetie? He's got to pick me. One clock left, y'all. Good luck, Hottie. Good luck, Sweetie. I definitely want to stay because the more that I get to spend time with Flav, the more I like him. I just want to say, the young lady that's going to be going home tonight, I mean, I like a lot, you know what I'm saying? But I don't think she really feeling me like that, you know what I'm saying? From the heart. I honestly was not expecting it between Sweetie and Hottie. I don't want Sweetie to leave, but I can do without Hottie. Yo, Hottie, come get this. Sweetie and hottie. I mean, hey, you can't take a chicken, put it in the microwave, and serve the damn chicken to my mom's hottie. But I felt that Sweetie wasn't really feeling me like that, you know? Thank you, Flav. When he called my name, I was cheering for joy. I was like, woohoo! 
and I turned back and none of the other ladies were clapping. I was like, look at those two face chicks. Sweetie, I get some love. When you said I don't care about you, that's not. I get, like this is a joke to me. You said the person leaves tonight doesn't care about you or is not feeling you. Yeah, I don't think you really feel me like that. I don't think you was feeling me like that for real. I'm gonna keep it real, home girl. This is a real decision that I made for real, and this is from my from my true feelings right now. And I had a one on one with each one of y'all. This is. But I feel, I don't feel you really feel me like that. You feel me? Are you kidding me? <laughs> you have to be kidding me. I freaking cooked a chicken for you today and I can't even stand chicken and everybody knows that I was crying my ass off. Someone else makes a joke of it and presents it in front of your mother and you think I'm not feeling you? I stay up late at night waiting for my date and I'm not feeling you? That's true, this is, a, this is a situation. I don't think nobody was expecting Sweetie to flip like that. People are images and reflections of yourself, so maybe you're not feeling yourself. No, it's not that I'm not feeling myself, it's just that I'm not feeling you. Okay. The time is up. Thank you, I appreciate it. Excuse me. You don't give it to me if it ain't real. No, it's real, I just think that's up. But I'll still pray for you, you'll be all right. And I'm gonna pray for you too, and you're gonna be all right too. And God bless y'all. Um, yo, check one, two. Um. And then for somebody to stand there and tell me that I'm not real, are you kidding me? I'm not f***ing real. And the way she left, that was whack. But your man Flavor Flav looks forward, not look back. When he left Hottie, who made a chicken to be presented in front of his mother that she stuck in the microwave with carrots and stuff, that's a freaking joke. When he left someone who was in the tea room saying to his mother, I'm in love with your son, and she had never even had one-on-one -on -one time with him, that's a joke. A sweetie. When he left a girl up there who's running around talking behind everybody's back, that's a joke. So he left a lot of jokes in there. So Flavia retarded. You're retarded.